Hi, I'm Danny Seo, author of the book Upcycling, and today I'm going to show you how to transform your collection of hotel key cards into a really beautiful and wonderful breakfast and bed tray. Um, if you're a road warrior or if you're someone who just loves to collect these when you go to wonderful uh, bed and breakfasts or hotels around the country, or if you're lucky enough, around the world, um, you always wonder, what do I do with these key cards? You put them in a bowl, you put them in your junk drawer, but they really don't have a function. Well, I was thinking they'd be great to use in place of tile to grout into a tray. Uh, the first step you want to do is get your collection and choose key cards that are important to you, um, are really beautiful to look at, uh, might have some kind of a meaning to you. So like this wonderful one from Buenos Aires, you know, obviously that's a keeper that you put in here. I find it's really important to actually lay the cards out first, look at the configuration, see if you're happy with it uh, before gluing them down. Once you're happy with the configuration, you want to take a hot glue gun, and I'm just going to pop these out. And then you want to just put a little bit of glue on the back of the card, like this, and press it into place. And I'll just do a few more. It's such a fun project to do, and I have to say, this is probably one of my top favorite projects that we did also for Every Day with Rachel Ray. I mean, who wouldn't love to get breakfast served to them on one of these handmade trays? Let's put Amsterdam over here. And how much do we love this actual key, key card? All right, so now that I have four of the cards down, the next step in the process on your unfinished wood tray is that you want to use something called an unsanded tile grout. Uh, one of the things that I love about Michael's is that you don't have to go to the hardware store to get grout, where they only sell in those great big giant bags for home improvement projects. For something smaller like this, you can get it pre-mixed. It comes in a little nice little container like this, and this is more than enough to do several trays. The key thing you have to remember is look for unsanded and not sanded. If you use a sanded grout on this project, it's gonna scratch up the cards and you won't be able to read what they used to be. With unsanded, it's a nice smooth surface to work with. Um, this white grout right here, make sure you wear your gloves because it says so on the instructions. Just use your fingers, which I think are the best tools in any craft area, and spread it in between each card. And don't worry about getting excess grout on top of the cards. Don't worry about doing a perfectly neat job because this is all gonna wipe off in about 20 to 30 minutes with a wet, damp sponge. So you can see already in this corner right here, I'll do the edges while I'm at it. You're getting a professional grout job right here. 20 minutes later, you just wanna wipe it off with a damp sponge and then let it dry overnight so that the grout has a chance to completely cure. If you wanna paint the tray, cover the entire inside with painter's tape and then paint the outside in the color of your choice. When you're done, you've got yourself a beautiful hotel key card breakfast and bed tray. Cheers.